Welcome back, Team Hypercube viewers. We are about to go on a hike. So here's my question. Are they also hiking or are they just flying and you're trying to keep up? No, I think they're doing the yeah, pigeon they're just like, waddle boop, 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 thing. Boop, boop, yeah. Boop. Yeah. Oh, you guys about bobbing heads. You excited to see who I get to talk to? Uh-huh. No. Talk to you. Da, da, da. The Geki's not even going to be there. He doesn't Probably like not. the sun. Okay, so. He's not there. Best friend Ryota. Which one was Sakia? I think that's the douchebag. No, that's, no, that's the that's, that's no, Draco Sakia Malfoy. Is, Saki is the brother of the douchebag. No, that's you. No, no, no. You. Yeah, Saki is the fan oh, yeah, tail. Yeah. The fan tail, like the royalty. He guy. okay. He's he's Draco. Yeah, yeah he's Draco. So Ryota's Ron. Saki is Draco. San is. <laughs> Might be the doc. Diggory. Dur no, San is the. Is that the teacher? San's the track guy. I yeah. Think. Sa San's the bird. Son is the bird bird. Oh, the chicken boo. Yeah, Son is the double bird. Oh. And Kazuaki is, is the teacher. The teacher. Didn't he keep calling himself Okosan? Yeah. Yeah, that's okay. his first name. I don't know. Who should I talk to? Not Pudding Man. I don't think I want to talk to D D Double Bird. I think you should talk to Double Bird. Um. I mean, everyone in the comments thinks she should talk to Double Bird. Okay, we're talking to Double Bird. He's my favorite. We're talking now. to Double Bird. I wonder where Okosan went. <laughs> <laughs> it's not here! The bunny is not here! <laughs> ah. It's missing? Did you bring it to eat for lunch? No! Uncle Sun believes that wonderful pudding could be found on hikes! <laughs> Who told you that? <laughs> is there a kind of pudding that lives on the mountain? I love him! <laughs> I mean, actually, depending on which uh, fantasy game you play. The little, like, slime pudding people. Oh, yeah. I'm waiting for my cue. Oh. Cool! <laughs> Okozan will now search elsewhere for the pudding. I hope you're happy. I hope there was like a like a roadrunner uh, <laughs> noise just now. <laughs> what kind of pudding is he looking for anyway? Me 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 me. I hope you enjoyed your hike. <laughs> that was that, it. That was definitely the right choice. Oh. I think everyone agrees that that was the yeah. correct choice. Um. Okay, so here's the thing. With math class, you'll clearly get more whiz. All right, let's do it. Going to math class. Okay. Why is math an elective? Oh, <laughs> I'm not getting this at all. It's because your wisdom is one. Maybe you should review the basics a little more. I love bird. <laughs> yes, sir. I imagine like big fat anime tears, like. <sighs> Burger leveled up. Wow. Oh man, I'm I got my smarts on. Nerd. You're a teacher. You can't <laughs> be a I'm, I'm imagine you're all well aware, but the sports festival is right around the corner. What the heck is a sports festival? You know. Please think about what you'll do. Sports festival season already? <laughs> huh? If it were in the fall, it would conflict with the cultural festival, so it's always been in May. What are you gonna do, Ryuta? I just like school. <laughs> I haven't decided, but probably the three-legged race. Some birdie has to. I need a friend, though. Koo! Of course I will handle the marathon! Indeed he will! <laughs> you do have a lot of stamina, Okosan. What That's about... what she said! <laughs> what about you, Sakia? <laughs> you can't possibly be expecting me to run in some race, can you? I think you need to roll your R's more. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll do race. My, yeah, okay, I'll do my best. <laughs> it is a sports festival. Is there an event that doesn't involve running? <laughs> that is so sexist. <laughs> no, he was talking to Sakia. How about being a cheerleader? The general, in other words. Very well. Leave it to me. <laughs> the general. <laughs> yeah. Um, I don't think that. Also, the first aid team is always shorthanded, so I'm sure they could use help if any birdie still can't decide. That's all for today. <laughs> Reed is doing the three-legged race. Okosan's running the marathon, and Saki is a cheerleader. <laughs> Yuya might be running the first eight tent. 
Is that the doctor? That's no. the brother. Oh, that's the brother. Yeah. I believe the, what should I do? the doctor's like son. I'll have to so think about it. S U U N. Oh, yeah, it was S H U U. I think it was Shu. Shu, yeah. Yeah. Oh, guys, today's the sports festival. Wow, hey, it's the sports festival. <laughs> I did make up my mind. What should I do? Go to the. Okay. Oh, man. Oh, man. Go to the library. No, or... screw that. Well, I feel like... I didn't want to hang out with you today anyway. She kind of wanted to hang out with Yuya. In the first aid tent. Or should we go make fun of the cheer... I don't know, man. I want to go to everything. I know. Uh, I don't man, know. life is really I don't hard. know. What should I pick? I mean, it looks like uh, cheerleader or first aid tent's uh, up to you. Let's go to the first aid tent. Salutations! Did you come to gaze into my eyes, Moon and me? Um, I heard the first aid team was short-handed. Salutations? Yeah, we don't have hands. That's really offensive. <laughs> I was gonna say short-footed? <laughs> short short beaked? Alas! Spurned for the sake of medicine. I must work harder to prove my love. God, what are you, Keanu Reeves bird? Anyway, happy to have you. As you can see, we have plenty of work to do. Ah, Dude. the obstacle course always does hurt a lot of birds. Why use a game designed for humans? <laughs> Beyond me, mon ami. I suppose it's tradition. <laughs> Where's the doctor? Shouldn't he be here too? Over there. He's resting in the shade of a tree. Mm. He's, it, wait. You just skipped over the part where he's taking notes on the performance of some of the students. <laughs> yeah, that's weird. <laughs> I don't see why. What is weird. he doing over there? He doesn't want to ruin his girlish complexion working in the heat. He does the same thing every year. I've been here like eight years so far. Is he taking notes on something? A lot of the birds graduating from this school get scouted by pro sports teams. So maybe he's checking up on the promising ones. They're birds! <laughs> pro sport birds! Someone needs uh -oh. to be the mascot. They've started. We'll be busy soon. Get ready, Mona Me. <laughs> Show. Yes, sir! Hey, sir's my father. <laughs> Call me you, yeah. <laughs> And so I spent the sports festival patching up damaged dubs with Yuya. I learned some first aid from him, so it was time well spent. Dot dot dot! Dot dot dot! Think? <laughs> yeah, and you didn't have to hang out with any of the weird other birds. By the way, it was April, because look, it's May now. Oh, okay. The first barrier for all students who make it this far, the midterm exam. I did the midterm already. I don't think I did too well. <laughs> I did bird! <laughs> You worked hard. Keep going like that and you'll do it just fine. One day you could surpass me. I'd love to see that. You're a bird. Also a teacher. I guess I did pretty well after all. And Mr. Nanaki seems happy with me too. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> with the festival and the midterm over, there's nothing to look forward to but summer heat. Wait, the midterm was literally like... Three lines. <laughs> yes. Yes. Dub smell kind of funny when it gets humid like this. Ugh. There's a bunch of birds in front of the staff room. What are they doing? Striking. Oh, there's Yuya! Uh -huh. Yuya! What's going on? Salutations, bird girl! Brian won his seventh Pulitzer. He gestures at a news clipping on the staff room pin board. It says, Brian, the first intelligent pigeon, crowned again. First, Brian? Don't tell me you don't know who Brian is. I I think I've heard the name because it's like a really, really, <laughs> really common human name, but Yeah, like everyone's named it. <gasps> He's the world's most famous blogger. <laughs> <laughs> no wait, wait, you gotta read the next slide. He began when birds were barely intelligent. <laughs> He's a very skilled and insightful writer. Look at him, staring off. <laughs> so deep, man. In the distance. He was the one who suggested that the Dove Olympics 
be called the Pidgey Olympics. He's extremely influential. The name was adopted <laughs> right away. Why don't you look him up right now, man me? Try Googling Brian Pidgey. I am on it. Do it. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh-oh. Lunch is nearly over. Adieu, <gasps> bird girl. Whoa, 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 what whoa, whoa, what? It's loading a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Today is a good day. I feel like I'm shining. Okay, I gotta interrupt this. When you search Brian Pigeon, Pigeon Blog shows up. Oh, what? Oh. what does that say? Pigeonblog.wordpress.com. Telling it how it is for pigeons everywhere. <laughs> oh. It's so great. My God. Okay, this seems like a good place to end the episode. Yeah, we were, we're gonna link uh, Pidgeo Olympics. No, blogs. no. Pigeon blog. Blog. WordPress. Yeah, yeah, that one. We're gonna yeah. link that in Brian's, the doobly-doo. Brian's blog down below. Required reading. <laughs> if you want to keep watching this, he's you gotta... extremely influential. Yeah. Oh yeah. No, you totally gotta go check it out. Uh, thank you guys for watching three episodes now of Hats of Full Boyfriends. Hats of Full Boyfriends. Hats of Full Boyfriends. Hats of Full Boyfriends. Um, Hato is a uh, pigeon in Japanese. Sure. Why not? Hato. Are you making that up? No. That seems totally legit. I'll yeah. believe it. I don't know Japanese, despite I... having taken four years of it. <laughs> uh, yeah, so that's all for this week. We'll be back soon with more pigeon shenanigans. Pigeonanigans. Pigeonanigans. <laughs> Thanks, Brian. Wait, did Brian say that? Yeah. Okay, cool. Then I'll say it. Uh, that's all. Team Hyper Cube, Cube out. out.